John T, welcome to Cheltenham. How good is it to get a deal here? Uh, to be honest with you, I've been trying to get this over the line for a while and thankfully it's finally happened. So, you know, I'm over the moon and just excited to get started. And it's obviously taken a bit of commitment from you because you could have been off playing for Bermuda, but obviously you've had to make a decision and I suppose sort your club future out first. Yeah, um, you know, I'd spoken to the manager of Bermuda and he'd contact me, asked if I was available for the upcoming games. And I just had to explain to him that, you know, I, I need to get my get myself sorted first and try and get this deal over the line. And, you know, he was very understanding and, you know, he won't hold it against me or anything like that. Fingers crossed. Uh, it's a short term deal, which I suppose really gives you the incentive to impress it and get a new deal in the new year, doesn't it? Yeah, you know, I'm I'm going to be working hard and coming in as much as often as I can, you know, coming in early, trying to do my extras to, you know, make that impression and more importantly, try to get in the starting lineup and score some goals. And you were here for a while during pre-season. How much does that help you now settle in or back in, if you like, around the club? Um, you know, it's it I actually settled in pretty quickly. Like as soon as I came in, you know, the lads were making jokes with me and asked me what I was doing here, I should be on Love Island. <laughs> but, um, you know, I settled in quickly and I under it gave me a chance to understand the manager's tactics and the way that he wants to play. So I'm, I'm coming in not completely fresh, but with a decent understanding of how he wants to play. And if required against Stevenish this weekend, presumably ready to go. Yeah, I'm, I'm ready to go. I'm fit. I've been looking after myself and ready to get started. How much does it also help that you know Wadden Road is a ground to play at as well, having had that time with Gloucester City as well? Yeah, you know, I, I loved playing here. The pitch, is, the pitch is fantastic. And, you know, I, I did come to see a few Cheltenham games while I was playing at Gloucester. And, you know, I'm just I'm excited to get started and get out on that pitch in a competitive match. You obviously are a taller striker than some of the others here and there is that competition but you do seem to offer something different yeah I mean you know you always back yourself and your ability to perform well and you know that's that's what I'm here to prove to get game time score goals and play well and you know make an impression yeah do you set yourself targets within that um I do set myself targets and goals but I want to get a little bit settled to to then you know, place my targets for myself and, you know, ideally achieve them. And not tell the media? Not yet. What are your thoughts on Stevenage? Uh, well, I was actually there for a little while, um, you know, training with them and they are, they are a good team and they do have a system of playing. I know they haven't had the best results of late, so, you know, their confidence may not be where it should be and hopefully we can take advantage of that. How recently was that training spell with them? Uh, that was in July. Right, OK, so you, you really do know yeah. what, what they're about and, and some of the players there. And I suppose, unfortunately for you, they'll also know a bit about your game as well. Yeah, you know, it does go both ways, but um, hopefully they don't remember too much, whereas, you know, I have a good memory. 